What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Jeremy here. You tune into another episode of House of Colossus, man. Very excited about today's review. Um, this was gonna come on the brand Savoir Faire from Mr. Chris Classic. If you don't follow him on Instagram, you should follow him. To all my returning subscribers, I appreciate you guys for rocking out with your boy on here. We're gonna take a look at this to all of the new subscribers, man, if you like anything in regards to men's fragrance, feel free to hit that subscribe button. I appreciate you helping the channel. You know what I'm saying? So let's hop right into it. <clears throat> so as you see, this is Savoir Fair. All of these are Auto Pop Farm concentra uh, concentrations. Um, <clears throat> I don't know why, man. My throat kind of dry today. Lord. But um, yeah, so we got Savoir Fair, Chris Classic. I actually bought his uh, cigar clutches, which is uh, his tester kits. So we're going to look at the presentation. And I'm going to give you what I get from these scents. And um, we're going to rock out with it. So as you see, Savoir Fair, it is a pull to open. So you put, pull, it, you pull it out and then you basically pop it open like that. Really, really nice presentation. It says, my very first customer asks an important question. Is this an everyday use or only for special occasions? I, re I realized that in that moment, Power of Fragrance replied, every day is a special occasion. I think that's pretty dope. Thank you for allowing Cyber Affair to accompany you on your daily journey, where with confidence, intentionality, and the best of energy. Classic. Then you go down to this. So it says how small business can create a culture of inclusion. Uh, obviously, you know, he was really famous for bringing out the whole thing with uh, H&M and the monkey, whatever thing that was going on back in the, I think this is probably about two, three years ago or whatever, probably less than that. <clears throat> However, you got Savoir Faire as a character far beyond common sense and befittingly, these fragrances offer a feeling far beyond most sense, hand blended and bottled by. Artist Chris Classics, our affair is proud to be a pioneer among the new emergence of black owned fragrance brands. Brands. Obviously, you can order these at my Sour Affair store. Uh, the great thing I like about these too is that he has like the note breakdown in here. As you see, it says Soul Cafe has tobacco, bergamot, orange blood, black pepper, patchouli, private must blend, amberwood, oud, lavender, and arabic coffee, and firewood. Beau Noir has. Uh, Emberwood, patchouli, cannabis, flower, essence, um, private oud, cilion, cilion, I'm sorry, uh, cinnamon bark, cedarwood, eucalyptus, bacor, musk. Um, signature has tomato leaf, leather, labanum, oris, oud, firewood, myrrh, sandalwood, musk, and amberwood. All right, cool. So let's see what these bottles look like. I have seen them. I'm just basically just presenting them to you guys, man. So let's go. As you guys see, that's what that looks like on the back. Has this little card. Pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? So I thought that was really cool. The presentation on this was dope, man. And boom, there's your bottles, man. So you got Signature, Beau Noir, Soul Cafe. Um, I'm going to let you guys know, man, all three of these are bomb. All three of these are bombdiggity.com. Um, what I get from Signature, Signature is very dark. It's a manly man scent for sure. Um, you do get uh, the leather for sure. There is a musk in the dry down and sandalwood in the dry down. However, it's not like a sweet sandalwood. It does have a creaminess nature about it. Um this signature is probably out of the three it's probably the one i don't like the most um and that's just me being full-fledged 100 with you all right so on to beau noir beau noir is a beast all of these fragrances here for sure for real for a man you probably only need probably two three sprays max for all of them or if you do wear more than two three sprays you probably gonna choke somebody out because the concentration in these and the 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 siage and the bubble, man, these project. They are beast mode fragrances to me, in my opinion. But to Beau Noir, 
I get that eucalyptus in the opening, then it dries down to this musky, uh, clean scent. There is that oud in there that kind of makes it a little earthy and a little, it's not animalic to the point where it's unbearable. It's just, it's just adds like this, this depth and this heft to the, uh, uh, to the fragrance. And, uh, I think it's dope. It lasts a very long time. I'm talking well over 10 hours. These mugs pump into my favorite. Soul Cafe. Soul Cafe, you definitely have that bergamot and blood orange in the in the opening. Then it dries down. You get this musky amber. It's, uh, you also get some of that oud as well. The great thing about Soul Cafe and the reason why I like it the most is because it depicts exactly what it says, Soul Cafe. If you've ever been to like a cigar lounge or something like that, and then like it has like that, you know how it has like that smoky ashiness in the air. That's what I get from Soul Cafe, but you get that. It's like it's like dipping your cigar into like some like a orange or something like that. But it is absolutely phenomenal. That's kind of like the best way that I could like describe it. Like I said, it has that orange, blood orange in the uh in the opening, and then it dries down to like this powerful, uh um smooth, musky oud scent with a little bit of ashiness to it. And like I said, you just have to really just kind of like you gotta try these out for yourself, man. I paid 70 bucks for these, um, which I, I thought was pretty fairly priced. I mean I was going to buy regardless because I, I rock with Chris Classic. I like his music and everything as well. So I was like, it's only right that I buy the fragrances. So, yeah, man, like, I think these are phenomenal fragrances. If you have time, man, pick them up. This is from Mr. Chris Classic. As I said, this is Savoir Faire. Like I said, the presentation on everything was pretty cool, man. Like, I like the whole, you know, supporting black business thing. I thought that was pretty dope. As I said, these are all out of pot farm concentrations. Uh, he sends these from Georgia. All of these are handmade. And I think these are absolutely phenomenal scents, man. If if you got time, pick it up. As I said, I'll show you again. Those are what the bottles look like for the cigar clutches. His little, you know, his spill and everything that he has to say. You know, the art. I just thought everything about this was really dope. I know you guys see the fragrances in the background. I just actually made a video, so I wanted to do this because I haven't done this one, man. So, yeah. As always, man, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend about my videos. If you feel like this content I'm putting out is good and you, you want to share it with people, hey, do so. My name is Jeremy. You tune into the House of Colossus where we talk about everything man's fragrance. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe. Share. I appreciate you guys. Until we meet again, peace.